Christy from Homes and Things, and in today's video, we're going to be touring the 1447 Carolina. Now, this home is bad and bougie, okay? And I can't wait to show it to you. So, without further ado, let's get into the video. This is the 1447 Carolina. Really beautiful on the outside. Love all the different textures in um, the exterior. You've got vinyl side and you've got board and batten and then you've got a different kind of board and batten up on the top so it may not be a quaint on camera but this is charcoal gray you've got the white in the middle and that's a lighter gray up top so really pretty love 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 um the inside of this home can't wait to show it to you so let's go ahead and go on in because it'll be a little difficult to walk around the back of this one so let's go on in and show you the home all right so this is what you see when you enter the home i'm just gonna come here for a moment and show you the front door when you walk in this is the front door you've got like a little entry right there to do as you desire i personally will put maybe just a bench there nothing much because you don't have a lot of room but i like the fact that this is kind of a entry itself so really pretty i'm always talking about that i think it's important to have an entryway in the home your living room is the first thing you see when you come in and look to the left really nice space you guys you've got your tray ceiling up top with can lighting i will put a ceiling fan in the middle um but as is it's still beautiful again this is your living room love it love all the space that you have in here now this sectional is the larger sectional but i love a sectional you guys know we have one and they just, you can split it up or you can keep it together and it still looks nice. You've got a built-in fireplace and a space for your TV up top. I love that it's catacornered. This is what it will look like. Sitting on the sectional, watching TV, and then you've got your living room and kitchen right here. So that's how much space you have in this living room, you guys. That is how many, that was quite comfortable too. Lots of room for furniture in here. They've got a large uh, coffee table and then an end table. You can do two end tables in here if you chose to. So really like nice. So again, that's your living room area. And then you look into your dining room and kitchen. So here to the right, well, we'll start in the kitchen. Here to the left, you have your kitchen. You've got this butcher block type island top, which is really lovely. A lot of space on this island, even though you have this huge industrial sink, you still have a lot of space. So if you're entertaining, then you washing dishes or rinsing vegetables wouldn't interfere with your guests eating or your kids doing homework or whatnot. A lot of pantry space right here around your refrigerator. And then you've got the same antique white cabinets on the exterior of the kitchen cabinets, but you have a different countertop, a lighter countertop, almost a marble look, really lovely. Love the charcoal gray um tile this is real tile here you guys really lovely love all the space you have in this kitchen and all the cabinets those cabinets there these two are catacorner love it love it so that is what your cabinets look like they almost go up to the top of the ceiling really lovely you got a transom window here and you've got a built-in microwave. And for every cabinet, 
in your kitchen area, there is a drawer. So really nice. More storage space over here. You can see probably four of those bar stools. Yeah. You can see four of those bar stools at this island. So you got lots of space on in this island. Really lovely. Love it. And then next to the kitchen, you have your dining room. Love it. Got a nice round table here. Lots of additional space in that dining room. So if you wanted to get a huge rectangular table instead of a round table, you got lots of space to do it. They have a sort of a, well, this is like a sofa table, but if you wanted to put a buffet here, you got room to do it. Two large windows here in the dining room, helping to bring in natural light um, in this space, which is really lovely. I love the fact that they put this lar those large windows there because they're not windows that open in the kitchen. You have this transom window, so really lovely. It doesn't make this area look dark at all. You got this barn door here. If you're not really a rustic person and you decide not to go with the barn door, you can think of uh, just putting a regular door here if you like. But this is your laundry room. Got this huge sink here for washing out things by hand and cabinet space. You got space here. Even though that's your electric box, if you want to put maybe a deep freezer there, you can. You've got space for your washer and dryer. There's your back door right there. Your water heater goes in this closet, just in case you thought it was a um, regular closet and your AC unit goes in there. So you can't, you won't be able to use these spaces for like closet space but that's where your items would be. So very nice, nice size laundry room. I'll go over here and let you take a look. And I always love a laundry room with a sink. So really lovely. So again, this is your living room, kitchen, dining room. And I'll give you a scan before we go check out the additional bedrooms. Really nice. So we're gonna go back by the front door and then around this corner here, you have a coat closet. Really lovely. And then you have, let's make sure the lights come on. So you have additional bedroom number one. So that's your bedroom. This is your closet. So you got a nice walk-in closet here. Really nice. I'm standing in the closet to kind of show you how much space you have. And I can actually back out here. Love that it's finished drywall. Really lovely. Next to this bedroom, we passed it, is your additional bathroom. Really pretty. Love the colors they use in here. I'll take you, allow you to take a look at the tub shower combo there. Really nice. Got cabinet and drawer space there. Yep. That's your bathroom, really nice. And then past this hallway, you have your second additional bedroom. Another walk-in closet for the wind. Really nice. They got it right, y'all. Most of the homes that you go in, they do not bring the shelving all the way around, but they got it right. Really lovely. Really nice. 
love it all right so that's additional bedroom number two as always if i have the uh specs they'll be on the screen okay all right so i'm gonna walk back through the living room and take a look at the master so right here off the kitchen you have the master it's so cozy it just feels cozy like when i walk in this room it just feels cozy. I love that in a bedroom. I love it, love it, love it. Not like my bedroom that's just got too much stuff in it. It just feels cozy. I love it. They decorated this room really nicely. Perfect. And then you have your, the primary bedroom's closet right here. Lovely. That's really long, you guys. It's narrow, but it's long. Okay, so all of this space is closet space. That's the door I just came in. So really nice. Love it. Love it. And then here, you have the primary bathroom so you've got your huge soaker tub here i love how they put the cotton in there to make it look like bubbles really nice you got a transom window up there and you also have a transom window over the shower so beautiful love it you got your tub there you got your huge double sinks here with makeup table in the middle really nice three big mirrors so everybody can get ready at the same time, really nice. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. All right, and then you've got your XL shower here. Beautiful. Love the tile. Love this huge shower. You got a huge shower head here. Really nice, beautiful. And then you got a window that opens in your in your toilet closet. So really nice. And it's not like I'm gonna shut the door and stand over here by the toilet. All of that is your water closet, you guys. So lots of space in here. Window that opens, absolutely love it. Really nice beautiful so let's go take a look at the price so again 1447 carolina this home package which includes setup and delivery is 160 84 so really nice it's a three bedroom two bath 1543 square feet Hope you guys enjoyed the tour because I absolutely enjoy bringing it to you. If you love these types of videos, make sure you hit the subscribe button or the follow button and you check us out in the next video. See you later.